live radar, your three-minute advantage, so you'll know first. This is WVTM 13 Live Doppler. After another hot afternoon, it's actually kind of comfortable out there this evening. Some drier air has worked in, dropping humidity levels. It only lasts for about a day and a half, but it'll make tomorrow feel a little better if you do have outdoor plans. 79 degrees right now, Regions Field, downtown Birmingham, clear skies overhead. So lower humidity in place for tomorrow. Father's Day won't be too bad with a good amount of sunshine. Still hot in the afternoon, but the lower humidity helping things out. Awfully hot though next week. We're going to see temperatures soar. Upper 90s to close to 100 degrees, especially for the middle to end of next week. And we're talking heat index values that will easily surpass 105, approaching perhaps 110 in some locations. Still very warm in Tuscaloosa this evening, 83 degrees, but you can start to see some of that cooler air moving in from the north. Coleman down to 66, Gadsden 73 degrees. It'll be nice in most spots overnight tonight. First thing tomorrow morning, temperatures in the 60s in many locations. Lots of sunshine throughout our Sunday with temperatures warming eventually into the lower 90s tomorrow afternoon. So yes, still hot tomorrow, but if you find some shade, a little bit of a breeze in place, it'll feel much better than the past few days. But like I mentioned, those hot, hot temperatures, they're coming back Monday, mid 90s, Tuesday, upper 90s, Wednesday, approaching 100 degrees, running about 10 to 12 degrees above average, even for the first couple of days of summer. And so, yeah, if you don't like the hot weather, unfortunately, it looks like we're stuck in this pattern of very hot temperatures and mainly dry weather. I don't see much in the way of rain chances over the next seven days. 91 tomorrow, a little less humid, but then the humidity returns. The hot temperatures come back Wednesday near 100, likely hitting 100 in many spots Thursday, Friday into the start of next weekend. And like I mentioned, not much chance for rain in that seven day forecast. You're watching WVTM 13 News.